This half hour, a power struggle turns destructive in a Jewish community in Rockland County. Several people woke up to find their car windows broken and vehicles vandalized, and they believe the synagogue's rabbi is behind it. Eyewitness News reporter Joe Torres is live in Ramapo tonight with more. Joe? Shade, here we are in the midst of the high holy days, and Ramapo police tonight are telling us they are investigating accusations of vandalism within the Hasidic Jewish village of New Square. Well, tonight, the victims not only told us what happened, they offered us some background. The whole issue is only about control. Control, say these Hasidic men from New Square, over who organizes religious services within this tight-knit Jewish community. The men did not want their identities revealed. Here's why. Early this morning, someone smashed windows of five of I'm their cars. I'm afraid, car. but still, we're not going to stop. So far, as of now, we're not going to stop. It's a good deed. This afternoon, the men filed a report with the Ramapo police. They believe the vandalism is really a message from the leadership here at Congregation of New Square. The message? Stop holding weekly prayer services with the elderly Jews at this nearby nursing home. We're not doing it just, just for fun or anything else. It's just a good deed that we're trying to help the, 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 the old people. They are so lonely. They, they have nothing in their lives. We called and then visited the rabbi at Congregation of New Square. We were told he was unavailable to respond to the accusations of vandalism. The men, meantime, told us their ministry with the seniors will move forward. This gives them life, gives them spirit. Mm -hmm. Somebody's coming to them, talking to them, praying with them. We asked the men if there was any way they could approach the Jewish leadership to talk about coming to some sort of amicable solution. They told us community leaders already tried that, and the response was this. Heaven and earth will come together before the religious services are allowed. Live in Ramapo, I'm Joe Torres, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Okay.